What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. It is day 83 of paying back my £12,500 loan. I took out a loan to go move to Dubai on a commission based job at the start of 2023 and now I'm doing a 100 day challenge to pay it off and um, we have 17 days left. Wow. You know what? I am absolutely exhausted. We have been non-stop over these 100 days and yeah, I look forward to them being over, to be honest. But hey, we're at the last hurdle now. And it's time to go even harder than ever. I haven't made a video in a couple of days. My apologies about that. But it's been it's been okay. Yesterday, I worked at Benno Bark. The previous day, I worked at Domino's. I got called out by a Liverpool TikToker to do a darts challenge. And the forfeit was to eat 10 double cheeseburgers consecutively. So that's why on the previous video, I was a bit absolutely gone after them cheeseburgers i managed eight by the way but um this morning i am in stafford uh, ksenia's doing something nearby and i am about to go to pure gym i've just bought a day pass to this gym here i'm not in david lloyd's anymore my membership is is uh now been cancelled because it was 70 pound a month and i was paying for two just i think ksenia's got one more month left and then Hairs will be cancelled too, so we're gonna go somewhere else. But yeah, I'm going to Pure Gym in the area. I haven't been working out that often, I'm not gonna lie to you. So here we are. I think following on from this gym session, I'm gonna go to Tamworth, which is about it. It looks close on the map, but it's still 45 minutes away. I'm gonna get a Spudman potato finally, do a video there. Later, we're staying in the Titanic Hotel in Liverpool, and I'm gonna be filming TikTok videos and a YouTube video as well. But that YouTube video won't be out till the 100 day challenge is over. Titanic Hotel is a quite well-renowned hotel in Liverpool. It's actually got really positive reviews. It's quite expensive. I managed to get a room for the night for 122. And I thought, hey, we'll, we'll review this today. I've been doing really well with hotel reviews. So on TikTok, um, on TikTok, I've done absolute millions of views reviewing hotels, but the majority of them are poorly rated hotels. So today I'm actually going to a highly rated hotel. So I hope I can manage to get views on there still. So some of you may know on the previous video, I got a few questions and in today's video, I'm gonna be answering them. So let's get into the questions. So after the 100 day challenge, you should do a five day cheapest flights video. I do like watching them videos. Perhaps I will do that and we'll have to see we'll have to see but I'll, I'll write that one down how much do you need to make in your last 20 days to pay off the loan um mm, very interesting question it's hard to see with my expenses because there are many this car everything there are many i'm not gonna lie now i'm booking hotels to stay in or whatever i'm investing into making tiktok and youtube videos right now um we'll see a profit but i won't see that profit until the end of the 100 days so i don't i don't know i don't know i i have done really well so far i probably you know I, the, the previous 10 days i managed to earn 166 pound a day on average which is really good but do we have that in the bank mm. We'll have to wait and see. I don't want to give anything away, but I'm really happy with how things are going. I've paid since the start of the challenge already three separate payments towards the loan that just come out automatically every month. So I think the uh, the settlement balance is under 9,000. Very close. It will be very close. I can't lie. Here's a good question. If you get a good trade like a carpenter, you can make 200 to 250 a day. Seeing as I graft hard, why not? look into doing that i respect that that's really uh could be an option in the future but i also want to be a little bit honest about where my head's at i am very close to making 500 pound a day online i'm very close to that right now i'm making maybe 100 pound a day online which is amazing but i'm just very aware that that 500 pound a day is around the corner and that's what i'm aiming for and i, I see myself as someone who can have longevity in that as I feel like I'm very consistent and, you know, some people make fast money on the internet and YouTube and TikTok, fast money, and then it dies down. I like to think, I like to think of myself as the kind of character that can see some longevity in it. And um, I'd say I'm really close to that. 
and that's my focus right now but i'm not against having a trade or doing something like that in the future if all didn't go to plan but uh i'm really not in the plan i'm really not in the mentality right now or oh, what if that doesn't go to plan it's more like keep on going keep on going well somebody said what do i do if i manage to get a day off well if i get a day off from like Dominoes, I'll always have something else lined up. Amazon Flex right now is a good one. So I'll never be doing nothing on a day. It's actually a day off today. I took Ksenia here. I'm going to shoot a video at Spudman. Later, I'm going to shoot a video in the Titanic Hotel. Um, not an actual job today, but, you know, I, I can see myself doing... I could see myself doing better with the videos I shoot today than if I was in work today. But I'm always doing something and it's been that way from the start of the 100 day challenge, which is why I'm shattered. And my totals are pre-tax um, and pre-expenses. Uh, I just don't really think I personally have the mental capacity to work out everything because I'm always, you know, there's so much going on. I'm just trying to out earn my expenses and the taxes. I need to be paying uh, dominoes I get taxed on and uh, when I was at Ocado they got taxed 20 percent which is uh, that was annoying I need to fill in my own tax forms for TikTok YouTube the raffle every single everything it's a bit of a headache and I can't lie I can't lie I'm gonna have to reach out to an accountant um, probably as soon as the 100 day challenge is over and I'll have another challenge in mind but look if there is an accountant who watches me regularly, just just send me an email because I'd rather pay you to help myself than pay someone I don't really know, someone who watches the channel. Why do you never say how much you've actually paid back yet? Well, my friend, there are multiple reasons, to be honest, and I'd probably just ask you to think of reasons why I might not be disclosing, disclosing that. I don't want to advertise myself having loads of cash on hand when that's not the case. I don't want to tell you how close I am to completing the challenge before the challenge is over. That kind of thing. Right, just got to Tamworth on the way to Spudman to film a TikTok now. You know, this is my third attempt at getting a potato from Mr. Spudman, so I think today's gonna be the day. I finally try one of those potatoes. Well, it's my third attempt at getting a Spudman potato today. Finally gonna try out one of these potatoes. Hi, how are you doing? Yeah, yeah, brilliant. Thank you very much. Right, guys, that was today's video. Currently in the Titanic Hotel in Liverpool. Beautiful place. But if you want me to actually show you that, I'll give you a quick sneaky hint. Um, Feel free to subscribe to the YouTube channel because I'll be uploading that at the end of the 100 day challenge. To be honest, I'm quite eager to upload it now. So maybe if enough people ask, I will. Uh, guys, thanks for watching. Another great day. Thanks for all the questions. We'll have to do it again. Approaching the end of the 100 day challenge. Thank you so much. And it was good to finally get a potato from Mr. Spudman. See you next time, guys.